Doll Lovers, it's Ruby Red's World of Dolls, and welcome back. Thank you so much for stopping by. I hope that all is well, fantastic, and fabulous your way. I've got my mini me and her pooch saint here in this video with me because we are so excited. As you can see, we have the mini Barbie Land um, goodies here that we want to unbox and share with you guys now i'm not going to unbox the cars and the boats and the houses though i do want to show you guys those now i did end up getting all of the mini barbie land cars with the mini dolls and houses except one house that i ended up purchasing from walmart.com but now all of them are available on amazon.com so I got all of these from Amazon.com, and I'm just going to show them to you real quick. So you got the little boat here with the little mini doll, and that's the reason why I have my mini me here, because she's going to be getting these. These are for her, and she's very excited. And here is the next one. They were $5.99 on, um, on Amazon.com, and then here is the back. I'm just giving you the picture of how it looks these items are so adorable they're so cute I've had these for a while I got these on Amazon when they first dropped guys but I haven't opened them because I don't have a specific spot that I want to put them so I have not unboxed them yet so but I am showing you guys these all of these were $5.99 and then here is the last one and then here is the back of the packaging to show you what it looks like outside the box. Alright, so these are all the vehicles that actually came in this collection. I'm trying to put them back where I had them. And then I want to show you guys the houses. There were three houses that came in this collection. And I love these houses. These houses are awesome. So let's start with this one here. So these are all dream Barbie dream houses. So we have this one here. I want to say this one is the one that I got from Walmart because when I was hunting them down, this one for some reason, Amazon did not have it yet. So I went on Walmart.com and they did. And for a moment, I thought that it was going to be a Walmart exclusive, but that wasn't the case. Amazon just did not have it in stock yet. But now... Amazon has all of them in stock. Now the houses were $9.99 each. And then here is the next one. There's three houses in this collection. And then each one comes with a doll there as well. So we get these little mini dolls. And that's why my mini me is so excited. Because she's getting ready to add to her little doll collection. Because she has a little um, doll collection. And then here is the very last one. And then here is the back of the packaging. Alright, so those are the houses and the vehicles. And I'm very excited about those. Like I said, I've had them for a while. And I was waiting to get all of the sets that you're going to see here. Now I ventured out to the town that I go to. Um, that's a 45 minute drive with the Target and the Ross. And, you know, so many more stores are TJ Maxx, Hobby Lobby. You know, I live in a small town, and Walmart is the biggest store that is available to me. <laughs> um, Walmart, Dollar Tree, and the grocery stores. So if I want to venture out to more stores, I have to go 45 minutes out of the way. So, it was worth it today. I needed to go to Sam's Club because there's so many things at Sam's Club that I can buy um that I can't buy at Walmart so it's kind of worth it for the membership for me to have it so my goal was to go to Sam's Club but of course you know I'm gonna pop into all the stores now my first stop was Burlington Coat Factory they had a lot of stuff but nothing that interests me because sometimes you can find diamonds in the rough in stores like Burlington Coat Factory then when I left Burlington Coat Factory I want to say I went to the Walmart now when I went to the Walmart I had no expectations of finding anything because this Walmart usually gets in the new items before any Walmarts near me or Targets. But I wasn't 
had any expectations of finding anything. Then when I walked in the store, I hadn't been there in a long time. They had rearranged everything. And the toy section was no longer up front near the cosmetics and the um, soaps and, you know, all of that stuff. They have moved it all the way to the back of the store. You know, and I've been in Walmarts that are like that, where they have the toy section all the way in the back. So, I went to the back, went down every toy aisle, and then I finally went down the Barbie aisle. And there I was, to my surprise, they had the mini Barbie land. Now, they did have all the vehicles, but I don't remember if I saw any of the houses that I just showed you. But they did have all of the vehicles that I showed you. So, here we have the mini um, Barbie land that I found. These are the lipsticks. And here on the side of the box, you get a, a view of what you um, actually get. You get a tube of lipstick. Well, pretend. It's not really lipstick. It looks like lipstick. And you do not know what you're going to get. But in each tube, you're going to get a 1.5 inch doll, which is about 3 and something 81 centimeters. Okay? And then you screw it up and you see how we do it. And we're going to unbox all of these. I bought the whole box. And this is what you get. And this is the reason why I went for this. When you guys know how much I love the fashionistas. Fashionistas are my thing. But I haven't been buying them. Because they take up a lot of space. And I haven't been doing much with them. So I just decided to pull back. And then a lot of them are just. Uh, they just don't appeal to me like they used to. But. All, I think it's what, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. There's 10 available in this collection. I bought the whole box, so I'm hoping that I have the whole set because <laughs> nobody had been in the box, and I'm crossing my fingers, guys, that that is what happens. And then I picked up these two, that they have the whole case of these, but I did not because, guys, I have to stick to a budget. I already ordered all three of the Barbie at Barbie Style Fashion Packs. They were $25 a piece. And, you know, I just bought all these Barbie Looks dolls. And, you know, we still have another, what, this is just the, the fourth month getting ready to be the fifth month. So, you know, I got to kind of be wise. So, I did pick the ones that I know were my favorite, which was the Fashionistas. I bought four of these. I bought four of these. They were $2.88 a piece. I hadn't told you guys that. They were $2.88 a piece. So I got one of each color, hoping that that's going to give me, um, hoping that that's going to give me, um, different dolls. So this is these dolls here, as you can see on the back. I hope you guys can see that. So these are the, I don't know which ones you call these because I don't collect them. These are the pop reveals. Okay, that's what. It's right there on the thing. And it's so cute. It's so cute. I love this. This is so cute. And then I did purchase one of these. These are the color reveal. So I did purchase one of these. Now, all of them were purple on top. But there was one, two, three, four, five, six. There was There's six of these. But there was also ten in the box. So I decided that I would just go with one because I like these but if I don't get all these that's fine same thing with the pop reveal like them but if I don't get them I'm fine with it so we're gonna start with my favorites the fashionistas so where are my scissors so like I said I have my mini me here and she with Saint because they're excited about what we're getting so this is what the packaging looks like now people want to know if it's a hack I don't know what the hack is because even here with this let with this um, code here, the H Y F 19, all of these have that. All of the codes have that same. Um, all of them have that same code, guys. There's no difference. Every number is the same. Everything is the same on the packaging. So I don't see a hack. I do not see a hack at all. I don't see it. Even here at the bottom, all the numbers, I've looked at them. They're all the same. So the only difference is the tube. And being fortunate, it, being fortunate enough to find a whole case like I did. 
And like I said, I bought the whole case, which is what, $28 because they're $2.88. So almost 30 bucks. But I'll show you guys, I'll try to show you guys the um, proof of purchase and all that good stuff so that if that helps you find them or if that helps you. And then here are all the recent fashionistas. All right, so let's go ahead and get the first one clipped. But you know, guys, what, what I want to do is I want to go ahead and take them all out of the packaging so that it doesn't take me so long to do that and wasting time on the camera. But this is what the little packaging looks like. And we've already looked to see if there was any codes or anything that would help us um, determine which is which, but there isn't. So I'm going to remove all the lipsticks from the packaging so that it'll be, it'll save some time. All right, guys, I opened them all up and I kind of let, I, I did the rows according to the way they were in the box. So this is the top row and this is the second row. I do not think that it, that my box was touched. I don't think anybody had bothered the boxes. I think they were put on the shelf and nobody messed with them. So I'm going to go in this order so that if there's one in particular you want, it might help narrow down your um, possibilities of getting it. So, like I said, this was the first row. So, let's start with the first row. So, this is what it looks like. It looks like an actual tube of lipstick. As you can see, you got the Barbie logo. Then you got the little tube here. And I think we just pull this out and it reveals the doll. Isn't that just adorable? So, we got the doll. So, do we, how do we do that? Okay, so we just twist it and it lifts the doll up. So, it shows you the doll. So, here she is. I'm not going to take her out. But I'm just going to show you guys the doll. So that's her. Okay. So that's her. Okay. And then we got the next one. Pull it up. And twist. Oh, I just love these. This is a great way to get the... <clears throat> this is a great way to get the fashionistas without getting the big dolls. And then my me and my me can get... um can get her collection now I'm showing you this so you guys can see the colors and I'm hoping that that color is showing on camera the way that it actually is all right so we got this one pull it up and let's twist it to reveal the doll oh this is so much fun this is so cool this is so cool this is so cool all right let me pop this one up and let's twist her I like this this is so much fun and they're on a little doll stand and you can take them out of these right now I don't know exactly how we're gonna display them I was just so excited about getting home today and unboxing them here with you guys on the channel all right this is so cool this is so cool like a kid in the candy store the kid inside of me has never grown up. She never left me. <laughs> if you guys don't know that by now, you never will. But these are so adorable. All right, so this was row one. This was row one. So I'm going to back them up, and I'm going to keep the tube next to them. So that you guys... And then once I get them all open, what I'll do is... Um, what I'll do is kind of take one out and put it with my mini me so that you guys can see how they look with the dolls so that you can see that they're actually miniature dolls for your mini for your dolls your dolls get to have dolls and that is my daughter texting my phone all right so let's go ahead and start with the first one here pop off the top Oh, I got the can. We got the can. We got the can. There are supposed to be two cans in this collection. So there he is. This is so cool, guys. This is so cool. All right. Oh, the next can. So, yes, it appears. I still got three more to go. But it appears that I got the box. It seems like if you can get your hands on a case that has not been opened, you will most likely end up getting the complete set if that's what you want. I don't know how you're going to find out, 
unless you actually know what color the tube of lipstick is and that should help you narrow down because I know some people might just want specific ones but I wanted all of them I wanted my doll to have all of them okay all right Malibu <laughs> there she is they are so adorable these dolls are so cute trying to keep the doll with their lipstick all right and they're so detailed to be so tiny to be so tiny look at all the details They're so tiny all right so since you were the last one I'm gonna go ahead and pop you out of your stand so you just pop them out so here they are they are able to bend and sit as you can see you can place them in a seated position and I think they can stand on their own without being in the tube as you can see they can all right so let's see how it looks in my mini me's hanging now as you can see perfect doll so they're great mini they're great dolls for our mini me's I really like that a lot that's really cool I love this this is so awesome all right and then you can place it back inside the stand if that's where you want to keep them you can place them back inside their little it's probably gonna be hard to get that little plastic back in there I don't need the plastic anyway but I have the whole set guys I am so excited I was kind of hoping that that was going to be the case I was kind of hoping that because there were 10 of them in this collection and I was able to get the box that had 10 in the in it that was untouched I was hoping I was going to get all 10 and I was able to get all 10 of them and I'm so excited there were two cans I didn't realize there were two cans let me go ahead and remove the plastic from all of them these are so adorable so adorable so adorable but yeah I don't know how you can how you can do a hat because like I said the numbers are all the same you just have to know that's why I was trying to keep the tubes with the the lipsticks with the dolls so that you could see the colors but I also know that you know I don't have all that fancy lighting like some of the fancy channels do so I don't know how it's going to show up on camera no I don't check that out just look at the details look at the details it's awesome really awesome all right it's really awesome yes that's awesome all right that's nice that's really nice that's cool I'm excited so we got those so now I want to do the pop reveals so just like I did these I'm going to take them out of this packaging and we're going to open them up together all right guys I've got them out of the box and I think mean, they are just so cute look at these pop reveals now I have not purchased any of these actual sizes because you know I'm just I'm just trying to be smart and wise with um, what I add to my collection now unless there is a real awesome face sculpt that I want I probably won't um, buy any of these or unless I run across them real cheap on clearance and then I'll get them for my grandbaby but the actual packaging looks just like the real packaging look at that look at that it is so adorable I almost hate to and what I, I'm not gonna open it I'm not gonna take mine out but I am gonna show you guys all right so I got the purple and I got this girl so this is the one I got in this one okay all right because I kind of want to keep them like this I think they're this really cool can I stick the straw in there I can but I think that pops it right <laughs> I guess I don't know it actually feels like something as you can see <laughs> All right, so let's see what we got in here. I've got different colors. Okay, that's her. This is the purple one. All right. Like I said, I don't collect these, so I don't know too much about them. 
trying to let you guys see it. Can I open it without? Oh, yes, I can. I can take it out and show you guys the actual doll. Okay. She's cute. This is just so much fun. So much fun. I just think this is so adorable. It's going to be so cute on a shelf display. All right. So then we got this one. Got this one. Let's take her out. Show you guys her. So there's five in here, or is it six? There's five or six. I'm going to have to look at the packaging again. And with there being actual ten, with it being ten of them in a, in a case, and there's only five different ones, and you pick all the colors, you're kind of going to run into um, a situation of having to... Um, Okay, come on out of there. I don't know how you would determine how to get the sixth one. I'm going to look at the packaging. All right, so that's her. You know, I don't I don't know. I, I really don't. But, again, my local Walmart will probably get these in if they don't already have them in. I haven't been, um, I haven't been since last week. I want to say I haven't been since last week um, to check. Now this I'm not going to open because I don't want to open it because I think you're going to have to put it in some water to reveal what you got. But in the case, they all the packaging looks exactly the same. All the packaging was the same um, front and back, even the packaging that it came in. All the tops were purple. So, I don't know how you would determine, like I said, if I would have gotten the whole first five of the row, I probably would have definitely ended up getting um, at least five different ones, because I ended up getting these, but these are the ones. See, there's one, two, three, four, five, six. So, I didn't get the redhead one. The redhead one, or was it the blue one? What color was this one? Alright, let's see. Alright, she's the pink. She's the pink one, I'm trying to see. Okay, so she's the first one on the packaging. So that's her. Okay, so that was her. So, I don't know how I, you would determine to get the sixth one. I don't. And then this one, the blue, the blue was the purple one here. That's the purple one here for the blue, for this bluish one. And then the pink is this girl with the green shoes. That's her right there. That's her. I think I don't have the red head. I think the red head one is the one that I don't I don't have. So she's probably going to be the hard one to find because I remember this one is the chocolate girl. So that's her. All right, so in her color is that peachy color. So if you get all if you get different colors, you're going to get different dolls with the pop reveal. But there are six dolls if you want to complete the collection. And I looked at all of them and I got all, um, I want to say I think I thought that I did. I thought that I got all different ones. So, because I looked at them all because I was trying to get um, all five of them. One, two, three, four, five, six. So I only got four because the colors were the same. So I didn't get... I didn't get this one here, and I didn't get the redhead. So, we'll see. We'll see if I, um, I'm trying to find the case for the cutie reveal. Because I didn't open it. So, I want to show you, be able to show you guys the packaging. Where is the packaging?
Okay, so this is this one. All right, so this is this one that came out of there. So these are the actual dolls that you get. You get one, two, three, four, five, six. Now, I would have gotten all five of the top row or the bottom row. Then I probably would have had all five girls. If I would have bought the whole box, I would have ended up with all six. But then I would have gotten four duplicates. Because there's only um, six to collect and there's ten in each case and that was the case for all of them so you know I'm really excited about these they're really fun I mean they're so adorable they're the perfect size for the mini me's I mean I don't know whose idea it was to do this but they're perfect size dolls and toys for our mini me's I mean it's just so awesome I mean look at that perfect size <laughs> It is the exact size that it should be. And I mean, it's just awesome. And I'm just so excited. And I just had so much fun. And I was just so shocked when I went down that toy, that Barbie owl. And, you know, the Barbie owl starts at the beginning and it goes all the way to just about the end. Because when you get close to the end, um, just like in my local Walmart, you end up with the naturalistas. You know, you get to the end of the row on the usually on the left if you're going in and you got the naturalistas and um you got the fresh dolls um the fresh dolls collection they had those beats dolls from the fresh dolls they're very nice in person but it's again i'm just trying not to collect anything new now they did have the new fashion pack at that walmart for the naturalistas the one the one with the um, big butt with the bonnet they did have that for $9.97, but because I invested in getting the collect all these, I didn't get anything else. I just got these and I left it at that. So I'm really proud of myself because any other time I would have dropped the ball and I would have bought all of them and then I would have also bought those fashion packs. But I am limiting myself and I'm trying to do, you know, what I need to do. Because like I said, I ordered all three of the Barbie style fashion sets i'm really excited about those they have shipped so they'll probably arrive this week sometime and i'm really excited about those my only um pet peeve about it is that it seems the fashion packs only fit the regular body types you know they don't have anything that fits the curvy doll and they don't have anything that really fits the tall dolls either you know we have these beautiful barbie signature dolls but we didn't get a tall this time, but we do have talls. And I wish that they would give us some Ken fashion packs. I just fashion sets. I wish Barbie Style would do some Ken fashion sets. I'm really excited about them. They were $25 a piece, like I said, just like the previous ones were. And they're really nicely made, and they're really cute. But once again, you know, it looks like I'm seeing... Um, the plastic jewelry and all of that. I just wish that Mateo would get away from that. You know, I'll talk more about that when I do the actual unboxing of those. We'll talk about those. This was about these little miniature minis, the mini, the mini Barbie land. I just think it's so cute. So now I have to decide what and how I want to set up my little mini village, my mini town, my Barbie mini land. I really am because I want to display that. You know, I want to set it up somewhere and, you know, have that set up. All right, guys. I hope that you enjoyed this little unboxing. You know, I, I really enjoyed myself today. I had to get up and get out. I had, Like I said, I had to run some errands today. I did buy some Barbie items that are not toys, but Barbie. I bought two beautiful blankets from... I did buy something in Burlington. Oh, my goodness. I lied to you guys. I did purchase two Barbie big soft blankets in Burlington for $15 a piece. I did. I lied because you know they're going to look really good thrown across my new pink chair. If you follow me on Instagram, you guys saw my chair. I'm sitting in this chair now. This chair is so comfortable. I'm just telling you it is the most comfortable um chair with this style that I have ever owned and I've owned several. You know, I love it. It is so comfortable. And, you know, I could just sit in it forever. But, you know, you can't. I'm not supposed to sit that long. But I could if I wanted to. <laughs> All right, guys. Again, that concludes this video. And I hope that you guys enjoyed it. 
Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Don't forget to check us out on Instagram. We are Ruby Red's World of Dolls there. Continue being awesome, fantastic, and fabulous. And I will see you awesome, amazing people in my next video.